All right, uh, I'm gonna try and get this all in one take. Um, I just uh, recently bought uh, another, uh, my second SeaTech uh, trickle charger. Here it is, there's a box. Um, this is the MXS 5.0 trickle charger. Uh, comes with the main unit and uh, connection to uh, 100, 20 volt to your house. Um, it also comes with the uh, the jumper cable type clamps, the bag, the manual, and what they call the um, the eyelet connector connection. And that's why I'm making this video. I have a couple of Mercedes. One is uh, this 2012 E550, and it has a twin, twin turbo V8. Um, I didn't want to connect it to the positive and neg negative terminals out here and here. Um, I wanted to be able to have this connection on, my, on the battery with these eyelets and then be able to plug and play with this car and my other car. So what I had to do was take this cover off there's three three clamps that comes off and then you could pull this whole top off of your battery itself um, this piece here fits on top of the positive cable once you're done but you unscrew those with your 10 millimeter socket so use 10 millimeter here and then the other one pull them off put the eyelets on screw it back on and then i used um, a zip tie right here hopefully you can see that um, to secure it and i'm hoping this will uh I'm hoping this will work for me it's plugged in right now and it's, it's on, it's work, it seems to be working. Um, my next job will be doing the same thing, an eyelet um, that I purchased a while back in the other car. It's kind of a fancier eyelet. It actually lets you know uh, with indicator lights how well it's doing. So, what I'll do, and this is how you, I mean, it, this is the same engine as my, this is a CLS 550, a 2014, has the same engine as a, my 2012 E550. So you pop these off. This comes off and here's your battery. Pull this off and then the connectors connecting connection here to the positive is diff, a little different, but I'll be able to put the eyelet right here and the other eyelet over here on the negative, and then I will tie it here again with a zip tie, and then just leave it and plug and play with my SeaTech triple charger um, whenever I need to. All right, hope this helps.